Hey everyone, uh, it looks like we have a potential legit leak of a ton of titles from E3. Now when it comes to Nintendo, there's one particular title in this leak that really matters to us. Uh, but we're going to call this a rumor, although it's a really reliable one. Uh, and a lot of these other titles potentially might come to Switch, we just don't know. Because I'm not even sure what some of this stuff is. Because it seems to be from almost every company at E3. Now, if you wonder where this information comes from, it originates from Practical Rush 12 over on Reddit, who put up a predictions post. And normally, I don't cover predictions, right? Like, Samus Hunter has predictions out there as well, and I have chosen not to share those predictions because, again, they're just predictions. But what gave this weight was when Daniel Ahmed, a, a legit industry insider, somebody who's at uh, you know, a lot of these meetings is located in Japan, uh, said that these title names are indeed correct. And when Daniel Ahmed throws his weight behind something, he doesn't do it uh, willy-nilly. So because of that, it makes it look like, well, Practical Brush 12 was clearly leaking. Now, you might wonder who the hell Practical Brush 12 is. Practical Brush 12 is the only leaker to date that has a 100% track record on everything they've ever leaked. Uh, lots of Monster Hunter stuff, but also they leaked the entire former Nintendo Direct before the Nintendo Direct happened and got everything right. So this is all stuff that they know will appear at E3 or appear um, you know, around E3, the E3 event, Summer Game Fest, and beyond. So we're going to go through this whole list, uh, and it comes to a close with a very exciting one. Uh, for us Nintendo fans, uh, so let me just let me just go here. Uh, I'm not going to show images of some of these games. Uh, we're just going to be you, me, camera, having an honest conversation here. So we got Rainbow Billy, Among Us, Dolmen, Death Door, Trek to Tomy, Twelve Minutes, The Persistence Enhanced, Atomic Heart, Somerville, Back for Blood, Slime Rancher Two, Stalker Two. Stellaris Console Edition, Far Changing Tides, A Tale of Paper, Sherlock Holmes, Arietta of Spirits, Mortal Shell Virtual Cycle, Unbound Worlds Apart, Steel Rising, I Expect You to Die Too, Shredders, Lemnus Gate, A Plague Tale Requiem, Marvel's Avengers, Euden Chronicle, it's E I Y U D E N Chronicle, Wave Break, Diablo 2, uh, I think Diablo 2 R, I believe that's like the remaster or whatever. Uh, Research and Destroy, Replaced, Age of Empires 4, Ali Ali World, Forza 5, Grounded, Senua's Hellblade 2, Outer Worlds 2, The Forgotten City, Psychonauts 2, Rainbow Six Extraction, Rocksmith Plus, Black Skylands, Fract, Haunted Space, Graveyard Keeper, Game of Crone, Wizard with a Gun, Tumble Time, Inscription, Shadow Warrior 3, Phantom Abyss, Audio Clash, Core Keeper, Blacktail, Sifu, which is S-I-F-U, Disciples Liberation, Splitgate, DDLC Plus, Raiders Republic, and here's the big one to excite Nintendo fans, Mario plus Rabbids, Sparks of Hope. So not Mario plus Rabbids 2, Mario plus Rabbids, Sparks of Hope. So there has been a lot of rumblings, of course, for a Mario plus Rabbids game from a number of insiders, but nobody had really come out and just definitively said, we are getting this. Now Practical Bush 12 is not only saying that, hey, we're getting Mario plus Rabbids, Sparks of Hope with the backing of Daniel, Daniel Ahmed, but, but we got an exact title. Sparks of Hope. What does it mean? I don't know. We're just going to have to wait until Ubisoft shows off this game, likely tomorrow. Now, again, this assumes this rumor slash leak is actually true. Uh, I know there's some heavy weight behind it. That's why we're talking about it. But as always, hype responsibly. I'm not kidding here. I think all of us got you know a little bit of out of hand with some former stuff with like the Switch Pro. And yeah, I still think the Switch Pro is legit. I don't think we're going to see it at E3. I don't think we're going to see this thing until July or September, but that's neither here nor there. Always hype responsibly. So even if I'm super excited about this, which I am, hype 
responsibly, all right? So Mario plus Rabbids, Spark of Hope. That, that one really excites me. A lot of these other games, obviously third-party indie titles, all that jazz, you can go back for blood. We already know it's going to be there because there's an entire segment dedicated to it during E3. Uh, so, yeah, you know, we'll have to wait and see if a lot of this is true. Among Us, we technically already saw it at Summer Games Fest. Uh, so, yeah, honestly, I, I'm not surprised by a lot of this stuff. Um, and again, it's not, you know, every title that's going to be at E3. You no, know, it's not like he just dropped a list of, this is every single title that's going to be at E3. Well, no, like you don't see Nintendo stuff in there. Uh, you don't see any Capcom stuff. So you're not seeing every single thing. Uh, these are just the things that obviously Practical Brush 12 knows about. And then Daniel Ahmed is confirming. I'd be really interested to find out if Daniel Ahmed is Practical Brush 12. I don't think so though. Um, so yeah, that's, that's really cool. Um, I, again, some of these stuff, I don't even know what they are. Uh, there, there, there are titles I've never heard of, uh, but you know, Stalker 2 is really, really exciting going back through. Obviously, Age of Empires 4, I think that was a given. It'll probably be either, if not at Microsoft Showcase, it'll be at the PC Gaming Show for sure. Um, I'm really excited to, to, to find out that hey, look, uh, it looks like Sending What Hellblade 2 is gonna come back and make an appearance. First time since the Game Awards 2019, back when the Xbox Series X was even announced. Uh, so that's that's exciting to me. Uh, you know, I already, I'm already a Game Pass subscriber on Xbox, so uh, anything that's going there, I'm going to be able to enjoy uh, without having to worry about uh, spending 70 bucks or whatever. But yeah, I'm, again, th this is just stuff coming from Practical Brush 12, just stuff being, being you know, kind of confirmed by Daniel Ahmed. Still a spoiler, still a rumor, still a leak. It, it's nothing that we should necessarily believe this is true. But again, Mario plus Rabbids sparks sparks not spark of hope sparks of hope with an s uh yes just yes um i want to thank you guys so much for tuning in oh boy what a way to kick off our friday uh remember tonight uh we have a special pre pre e3 show eric will be there for that one sorry mr pumpkin he's just off camera you will not be at that show uh but uh, we have a pre pre e3 live stream tonight so hopefully you guys tune in before our big show begins tomorrow at 9 a.m. CT. But again, we will be actually starting the stream at 8 a.m. Uh, just for some technical testing. Although we're going to do a lot of that testing tonight as well. So hopefully see you all there. Bye.